back again Chale. i hope you are doing amazing today i'm taking you to the north of sao tome you see the way the island looks there is a south there's a center and there's a north today's tour is taking us to the north of sao tome i'm interested to know the history in sao tome so we have a tour guide with us hey, jp mm, here is one. going to be <laughs> our tour guide for today so jp say hi to everyone hi hi i hope hope you guys are doing well yes. Ghanaian team i hope take good care of you and yes. give you all the information necessary okay in my previous video i shared that we rented a car for 40 euros a day for a tour like this it's needed to get a tour guide to explain everything about Altome. this cost us 35 euros bella vista but why is it it's called bella vista because if you stand there at the second balcony and look at the back of us the view in the past not now with day was really good really nice really amazing so that's why they just gave the name rosa bella vista Okay. The bell right over there, uh, during the colonial time, they ring the bell 5 a.m. in the morning. All the workers stand here, and then they, they call it uh, Capitan do Mato. It's like a jungle captain. You just come, count the workers one by one, and then send them to the plantation. 5 p.m. in the evening, the process was exactly the same. So it was like sun up and sun down. That's to check who could run away or could stay because during the sleeping time some of the workers slaves they used to run away to escape so that the white side nowadays is a uh, government office they run a cocoa company okay the, the local people here they grow cocoa they buy and then they take it to the place we've just seen to dry okay today's vlog entails driving through all the tourist attraction places in the north of sao tome which are all free to access Uh, here was the place of the punishment. Okay. So when the slaves did all the way from Trindad, I mean from Batepa to Praia dos Governadores, this is the place where they went to get water from the sea right over there and throw it at, the, at this side. Okay. okay. All the way, I mean, do, all the way do, during hours doing the same thing. So if some of them tried to escape, the Portuguese just shoot at them. So here was the place that so many, around thousands of workers, slaves, they lose their life okay mm -hmm. thank god for mr amadoy just cut the neck of the, the mr gorgulio and put everything down mm -hmm. so you see the six plates right over there here you got the names of some of the slaves who lose their life during the massacre and all the all of them when they came they had a, a different name i mean african name mm -hmm. so when they got here came here the portuguese baptized them and gave a portuguese name so that's why you, you, if you read there, you see a lot of João, Pedro. Unfortunately, it's raining. And then, uh, Sao Tome became, I mean, you know that uh, Sao Tome in principle was colonized by the Portuguese. Yeah, yes. So, and uh, nowadays, Sao Tome in Portugal has got a very strong relationship. Oh, yeah. So, there are so many Portuguese coming Flamini. here. So, Euro became, let's say, uh, another second currency of it in the island. That's why we use Euro normally as another, uh, our second currency. Okay. The main one is Dobra, okay, and the second one is Euro. We also use Dobra, but not as much as Euros. So guys, as part of the tour, we are currently at a place called the Tamarine Beach. This place is called the Tamarine Beach because there's a lot of tamarine plants and if you haven't seen the tamarind plants before, this is how it looks like. The first time I saw a tamarind fruit was in the north of Ghana. Yeah, I don't know if you guys remember that video, but that was the first time I saw a tam tamarind fruit. So it's beautiful seeing that the entire beach is surrounded by tamarind plants. This is how it looks like. This is how the tamarind seeds look like. It can be used for medicines, ice cream, juices, and it helps lose weight. We are currently 
at a place called Lagua Azul, which is properly called Blue Lagoon. It's a small bay in the northern part of the island and it's a popular spot for snorkeling and diving. discovered the island of Sao Tome, the island was empty. That empty at all because there, there, were, there were people living in Angularish. There was a ship of slaves that were passing our coast and then the ship sank. They swim and settled there in Angularish. They were all from Angola, so that's why the name of the, the village is called Angularish. Okay, they were the first one in the island, but when the Portuguese came, I mean the Portuguese were the one who explored it. So the island actually was empty. They went they realized that our soil was fertile. So they brought firstly in 16th century sugar cane and then they needed people to work in the plantation. They went to other Portuguese colonies like Angola, Mozambique and Cape Verde. They went to contract people to come and work here in the plantation. In the contract they said, we're gonna give you health care, education, house and also a salary. They said, okay, why not, let's go. And then they came here. When those people came here, they work at the, but they never get paid. They never get paid. And when I ask for payment, the Portuguese say, oh, the payment, we are discounting your health care, your, yeah. your food. They say, okay, now we won't go back to our country. They say, no, because you have a country, you sign a contract. Yeah. <laughs> and then they were upset with the Portuguese. They were upset and they start to banish sugarcane machine. There was a rebellion in 3 February 1953 uh, because of that. They were angry at the Portuguese. They were mad at Portuguese because they, are, they were treating them bad. And then they start to burn the machine. When they start burning the machine, it happened in the center of the but island. I want to know mm. why is that um, it's Sao Tome principle? Yes. But Sao Tome is more popular than Principe. Exactly. Why? And that's because Sao Tome has got seven, six small cities. Okay. And Principe is only one. Let me know in the comment section which part of today's vlog do you find interesting? Is it the history? Is it the beaches? Is it the landscape? Let me know in the comment section. I hope you're enjoying watching. After a long day, it was time to have lunch and we made our way to a local restaurant here which is called the Santola. We are about to have lunch after a long tour yeah. and we are here at this beautiful place to have some crab which my tour guide has recommended so we are going to try it. I hope, I hope it goes well because I'm super excited about this seafood. So we're going to start breaking the crab legs. Oh, this is self. Wrap it in the napkin. Like this. Let's look at this. Oh, yummy. Mm. 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 This is good. So we brought some shit off from Ghana. We're going to add it to our. So she's currently using the crab sauce to prepare a sauce for me today. Yes. I know she's going to add a local beer to the sauce. This is how it turned out and let's taste it. So they call it the crab sauce. No, no, it's big mm. uh -huh. so as, yeah, that you are It's good because of the lemon. <laughs> it's nice, but the beer gives it okay. a funny taste at the back. But it's nice. She says it goes well with the plantain or the bread. So, yeah, cheers. After the lunch, we are going to the tunnel. I'm very excited. Ah, uh, yeah, the road is. 
the very popular tunnel here in Sao Tome. If you come to Sao Tome and you don't come visit this tunnel, then you didn't miss it. This place is beautiful. I hope the videos do justice. Wow, I'm really amazed. Look at this. It's so dark in color. How do they call people from Sao Tome? People, people from Sao Tome, they are called Sao Tome. Sao Tome. Sao Tome. Female or male Sao Tome. Okay, there's no Sao Tome. Sao Tome. <laughs> guys this brings us to the end of today's video i hope you found it interesting and educational let me know in the comment section which part of the video you love the most see you next time in my next video i love you all bye